Today I want to show you how to attach the clear plow snow pusher to your hand truck. And I'm going to make a few passes on this driveway, clear this whole driveway. It's uh, about an inch, inch and a half of heavy wet snow. And I uh, just want you to see the clear plow snow pusher in action. You're going to want to set your hand truck on its back on level ground. And then you'll take the clear plow snow pusher and attach it to the hand truck. There's two different versions. There's a 24 inch wide model and a 36 inch wide model. Today I'm going to demo the 36 inch wide. So to attach it, you're going to basically stand on this side of the hand truck, hold the clear plow pusher device like this, and with one hand you can uh, hold it so that it will slide over the lift plate. And to get it to easily slide over this lift plate, uh, have the uh, hex bolts loosened up so that they're flush with each handle. And that just gives you a little bit of a gap here. And you can slide this clear plow down till it, uh, till it hits the handle of your hand truck. If you want to have it to that point, you have to come up just a little bit. Um, but you can see on this particular hand truck style, we can raise this strap up to the end. And as a result, it changes, it allows you to change the height of your hand truck to fit your uh, particular preference. So uh, I'm going to set it so that it's about right here. Get it gently snug. Do the same for this side. Stand the hand truck up. I want to make sure that the cutting edge is touching the ground all the way across and it looks like it's not so let me loosen it up just a little bit so that it is. And then gently tighten, just hand tight, no tools. strategizing how you want to clear the driveway uh, in advance before you start doing it is going to save you a lot of headache. Uh, we don't recommend pushing snow to the bottom of your driveway because then you've got to deal with this big pile at the bottom. So what I recommend is you take a driveway and you split it in half, push the snow to each side. Depending on how deep the snow is, you may not have to split it in the middle, but ideally split it up the middle and push to each side. Now you can see that's some pretty heavy snow. a bit of an incline here so you want to be careful if you're working on an incline. As you can see the clear plow snow pusher will cut right down to the, the uh, pavement. It has a special cutting edge that makes it slide across the pavement, pavers, concrete, even wood decks very easily. Make sure you have secure footing when you're using the pusher. And just with a little flick of the wrist, you get the snow to exit the pusher and uh, go where you wish it to go.
if it is a deeper snow, then you could take a bite that's maybe only one quarter of the width of the pusher, like so. That way you're not pushing as much. So push as much as you feel comfortable pushing. Don't worry about the snow spilling off. This is intentionally not angled, so it allows you to stack it when it gets deeper. So you'll just go back and do a quick cleanup. I'm going to push up uh, the middle of the driveway a little bit further and as the clear plow fills up just steer it to dump it like I did on this first pass. As the snow fills up in front of the snow pusher, just steer it off of the walkway right onto the lawn. And you do that as you're moving forward by pushing down on the handle, which raises your clear plow pusher so that it'll float over the top of the lawn and you can deposit the snow on the grass. I'll show you. down on the handle and then this is some very heavy wet snow and just pushing it right off the walkway. Okay, so now we're going to clear the rest of this drive, or I am, <laughs> um, and uh, you know, it, it's, it is a little bit of a workout, no matter you know which way you slice it, but it is not something that's too much for me, and I'm almost 60, so, um, you know, again, push, push as much as you can, but uh, as most of us know, clearing just even snow that's inch, inch and a half of just heavy, wet snow is a nightmare, and if this were to be left it would end up freezing overnight. So we're gonna get this cleared off. So as you can see, this clears the snow using the leverage of your hand truck. And uh, you know, it's not a race to get it done, it's to do it so it's not a huge strain on yourself. And in fact, this uh, combination offers that. So as guys, we like to do everything super quick. <laughs> and you can see I'm going back and have to do a little cleanup. But this is a heavy wet snow, so there's not really an easy way to clear it, uh, you know, without a snow blower. Uh, so uh, this works very well.
So in this case, since the driveway is slanted this way, and it is a pretty steep incline, I'm going to be pushing the snow this way for this flat part portion, and then as we go into the incline, I'll probably push it towards the hydrant. just steer the snow where you want it to go. When it's heavy and wet like this, it kind of slides. Well, the snowplow contractor liked it, so that's a good sign. Well, thanks for watching and if you're interested uh, in a demo just let me know if you're local I'd be happy to come out and show you